Hi, I'm Steve from Apple World today. One of the stranger features of the iPhone and iPad is shake to undo. Let's face it, it just looks weird when you want to undo something you just did on your iPhone or iPad and you have to shake it. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to turn off shake to undo and replace it with a new special gesture. Now the way that Shake to Undo works is that if you make a mistake while you're doing something on your iPhone or iPad, you shake it to have it undo your last actions. Now that's fine, but if you accidentally move your device around or if you're working on it while someone else is driving and you're on a bumpy road, well, it can undo things that you didn't want undone. By the way, shaking a 12.9 inch iPad Pro to undo something just looks kind of weird. To turn off Shake to Undo, launch settings on your iPad or iPhone. Scroll down to Accessibility, tap it, and then tap Touch. About three quarters of the way down this screen you'll see a button for Shake to Undo. Tap it so it goes from green to white and you've disabled the feature. Apple added a new gesture to iOS and iPadOS 13 that can be used to replace Shake to Undo. It's a three-finger swipe from right to left. Now, in this example, I typed a sentence and I decided that I want to go in and delete the last word. Well, maybe I do want that word back, so using three fingers on either hand, all I need to do is swipe from right to left and the last change is undone. Well, let's say I want that original back again, so what I can do there to redo is a three-finger swipe from left to right to bring it back. And that, my friends, is it. No more looking like a fool shaking your iPhone or iPad when you want to undo something on the device. Just disable the feature under Accessibility Settings and then use that three-finger swipe gesture. I'll see you soon with another Apple tip. And remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel and visit appleworld.today for more Apple news and tips.